Long and the short, yes. Have you worked with the basalt? Yes, yeah, yep, yeah. yeah. love the stuff. Absolutely love the stuff. There's no, uh, what's, the, what's the term, spalling? Yeah. Spot spalling is when it rusts inside of, and then you start you losing. See, you and see it, bridges where all of a sudden you go on a bridge and it starts yes. falling off. And I got with the people that, that, that make the basalt. And I also got with another uh, Vancouver Canadian outfit, Gordon Shank, who makes the cellulosic material out of bio wood, out of pulp. Okay. And they burn the guts out of that down to basically a powder. And then they break the hydrogen bond out of that, and it's called fibrils, fibrils. And they're just little tiny hooks, okay, at the very smallest, uh, just above the molecular chain. And these fibrils, fibrils, whatever you want to call them, they, they, once you add water, they hook back up. So it's like uh, Velcro. Okay, can't take it off this way, but you can peel it off this way. And so that's what that's all about. That's the good bond on that stuff. <clears throat> We've chosen, I talked to him, I said, well, how do you feel about taking some of that basalt material, okay, and running it at a 45-degree bias, okay? So it looks like a carbon fiber material with a kind of a copper brass face. But it's only 15% less of the performance, total performance aspects of carbon fiber. So it's really light, a little heavier than carbon fiber. But it also does this with the NGO and the hemp. It self-repairs. 